Hello there. Thursday is looking bright with some sunshine, although we will continue to see showers across coastal districts and over the higher ground in the north, even falling as snow. All change though into Friday. It turns stormy. More about that in a moment. Some wet weather to come through Wednesday evening across Wales, the West Country, the West Midlands. Spits and spots elsewhere associated with this cold front behind it. The air is colder and with that we could see a touch of frost as the skies clear. A driving wind gales for a time across the north and the east of Scotland, bringing in those showers. And showers will turn wintry over the higher ground, so certainly the Cairngorms and Northwest Highlands. Showers also run down the west coast of Scotland, clipping Northern Ireland and down Irish Sea Coast towards the north coast of Devon as well as Cornwall. In the towns and cities, temperatures dipping down to around 1 or 2, 3 degrees Celsius. In the countryside, it will be lower, so expect a frost in places as we head through to Thursday morning. But Thursday will dawn bright and crisp with some sunshine. Still those showers, though, and still that driving northerly wind along the east coast of Scotland down towards eastern England. Inland, though, some fine weather to start the day. And again, we continue to see a rash of showers just moving down the Irish Sea coast. So again, expect one or two of those as you're stepping outside first thing on Thursday morning. More of a cloudier start towards the far southeast of England, but even here the cloud will clear, allowing some sunshine. So it's not a bad day all round, really. If you're going to escape the showers and that driving wind towards the east coast, it will be fine with some sunshine. But then later on, the cloud will thicken across the far northwest of Scotland, heralding some unsettled weather coming our way through Friday and into Saturday. Before that, though, temperatures rising to around, I'd say, five to seven degrees Celsius. Not feeling too bad in any shelter. So, yes, some bright weather to end the day. Now, through Thursday evening and overnight, a band of cloud and rain will sink its way down across the country again, some hill snow across Scotland. So some moderate bursts to come through Thursday night and certainly some strong winds associated with this cold front. Behind it, the air is colder and we'll see a rash of showers, which again will be wintry over the high ground. So by lunchtime on Friday, a wet morning and afternoon towards more southern areas and then those showers ramp up further through the latter part of the day as we head through to Friday. Now the Met Office has issued a warning for wind. On Friday that's for Scotland and Northern Ireland. Gusts along the coast could reach 70-80 miles an hour inland, 50 to 60 miles an hour and associated with that always outbreaks of rain. Now come Saturday those strong winds extend across England and Wales away from the far southeast so even here, we're expecting some really strong and damaging gusts for a time. The other feature of the weather as we head through the next few days will be this occlusion here. As it drags down towards the south, it's going to deliver cloud, outbreaks of rain, and that rain will turn to snow over the higher ground. So some disruptive weather coming our way as we head through into the weekend. But some good news through Sunday, things will quieten down. We should see some drier weather but then it does turn a bit milder as we head through the first part of next week. Before that, though, it's time to wrap up warm and batten down the hatches. More details, check out all our social media channels.